Welcome all. What are you doing there? Back to Majora's Mask. I'm trying to make him do like circles, but he won't do it. <laughs> okay. How's it going, everybody? Majora's Mask time again. How we doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are here welcome. once again to bring you guys some quality entertainment in the Zelda world. Oh yeah, I don't have a sword. Whoops! Okay, I'm gonna, um, why was that so high-pitched? I don't know. I'm gonna go <laughs> get more money out of LeBanc. Okay. And I, I really shouldn't have deposited any of it last episode, but oh well. And meanwhile, last time, um, yeah, we, something really bad happened Grave last misfortunes time that we won't talk about. I'm over it. I've moved on, and I'm excited to play this game again. <laughs> okay, good. It took a while. I guess and what we're doing this episode, everyone. Trying to get- We're gonna get all the fairies again! No, I'm kidding. Yeah, that's- the... I'm not gonna make you guys sit through that again. Um, but we are getting a new sword, are we not? Yep, but they need to forge it overnight, so we're gonna do other stuff in the meantime. Oh, um, why don't you just skip ahead in time, though? Well, there's other things that I kind of want to do, so I might as well just, you know, do it. Go ahead. I, I, you know, now the only issue with what happened is that I am concerned that I'm going to forget other important things, you know? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's, uh... I'm sorry, that, that, that conversation just dropped off. I took a sip of coffee. Oh, it's okay. I was busy, like, thinking, so... 580 rupees. Whoa. That's a lot of rupees. Well, it was more, but okay. Also, we have a little change of pace here. We're uh, recording in our video game room, which um, was still set up from the Donkey Kong Country live stream. So, yay. Which was awesome, by yay. the way. Yay, thank you, everybody who attended that. It was so much fun. It Thanks. was lots of fun. Sam, I know you watched this. Thanks. Uh, appreciate you coming. Steven, of course, like for coming. Um, Dave, of course, for coming. And, and some of the uh, new folks. Yeah, it was nice to meet Denny's. Um, yeah. It, he seemed quite entertained yeah, by us. Yeah, he <laughs> seemed quite... Enter another Brazilian friend, which is cool. Yeah. I feel like pretty soon we're going to have to go to Brazil, because we have so many people that we've met on the channel Well, that and Dave's Brazilian adventure, Dave's right? Brazilian adventure, yeah, that's going to have to happen soon. Um, yeah, it was fun. It was lots of fun. I woke up this morning, and I really badly wanted to play Donkey Kong Country 2. <laughs> so like, I apparently that. hadn't had my fill. I think what we should do, and that's what... By the way, that's what she said. Uh, but I think we should uh, do more Ocarina. Uh, I'll link to the past first, though. I know, and I will enjoy that too. I just am like really excited. Unless you'd rather do Donkey Kong Country too. Well, we promised the people. Well, uh, why don't we have the people comment? Yeah, I, I feel like Steven's gonna comment and say that he wants a link to the a past. A link to the past or Donkey Kong Country Two, guys. Well, either way, we're gonna do both. But which one are we gonna do next? Yeah, which one's next? Because then the other one will just be on. Well, will be the one after that. I think maybe we should do a link to the past. Yeah, we might as well get it done, but we'll Personally. see. Personally. Um... We'll have to rewatch some of that so I know what, what we actually did. Yeah, fair enough. Watch the last hour or something. Yeah. Anyway, um... I know we were trying to beat a boss in that one temple. But yeah, we're gonna do another live stream sometime in January, so... Yeah. Get ready for that. After the holidays. Probably, like, the weekend... Um... Maybe the weekend of our one-year wedding anniversary. Uh... Oh, yeah, maybe. I mean, our anniversary's on the Sunday, so yeah. we're gonna celebrate on that day, which kind of leaves Saturday, Saturday as open. an open day. Yeah. Maybe we could do that or something. That'd be fine. We'll see, we'll see. We'll let you guys know. Yeah. Um, or the weekend after. I don't know. We don't know what we're doing that far in advance yet, so... No, we don't, which is odd for us, actually. I know. Usually we have to plan months in advance. It's, I know. It's the nature of our lives. This is basically what happens, guys, for those who aren't in the know. Um, basically, since Rachel is from Canada and I'm from New Jersey and we live in New York... We live in upstate New York. I still won't say specifically where, but it's. You I feel know. like we've kind of come out with it before, but. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't matter. Uh, anyway, middle of freaking nowhere, New York. And anyway, since we live um, kind of in the middle, we. And we both. It's important to both of us see our friends and family. So we are often traveling to either Canada, where Rachel is from, or a part of New Jersey where I'm from. Look so, at this. Where am I now? I don't know where you are. I, uh, I'm on, uh, the Milk Road. Whoa. But look at this, I don't big, see any milk. But a big boulder's blocking the way. So it was up to some no-good mischief and blocked the road to Romani Ranch. I'm oh, sorry, no I'll remove it quickly. Why yeah, you good just luck with that, douchebag. Goron, punch it. I don't know why I called him a douchebag. I don't know what he <laughs> did. He did nothing. <laughs> nothing at all. Well, fortunately, I now have a big powder keg. I love how he knew. He, like, ran away. <laughs> look, he's freaking out. He's like, my hard work! What are you doing? Or is he cheering it on? Boom. Got him. He's like, oh man, I'm out of work now. See what he now. says. Let's see what he says. 
Hey, as long as it's open to traffic, it's so fine. Alright, so he doesn't care about the lost yeah. paycheck. Yeah, oh, oh well. He's gonna get paid either way if he works for the town. Maybe he's on salary, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. But, uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so anyway, for those not in the know, we basically, um... Wow, this going in here really reminded me of, uh, Twilight Princess for some reason. Weird. This scene. I don't know why, yeah. Oh, look, it's the moon. L look! What is that thing? It's a thing. Isn't that your horse? Cool. Is that? That's a pony. Is that Tattle's voice, even? I think so, yeah, yeah. Yep, it definitely is Tattle's voice. Little Epona! Well, how are we gonna save Epona? Let's talk to this, uh, cutie pie. Uh, hey, who are you? I'm Romani. I was given the same name as the ranch. Whoa. What's your name? Link? That's a nice name, but... It's actually Link! <laughs> how about Grasshopper? That's the name Romani gives you. No. See, you're wearing green clothes. And you're, you patter about when you walk, so grasshopper it is. Romani was practicing for tonight. Tonight. Mm, what's happening tonight? They are coming. <gasps> Whoa, that's kind of ominous. They. Um. They. By the way, my why friend? does she refer to herself as the third in the t the third person? Maybe she's insane. They. They come at night every year when the carnival approaches. <laughs> hmm. Whoa, it's weird. They're coming. What? This is so creepy. They come riding in a bright, shiny ball. A whole lot of them come down. Moo. And then they come to the barn. And? What do they do? Well, you saw there was a cow there. What do they do? What do they do? My older sister won't believe me. But Romani must protect the cows. They go for the cows. Hey, Grasshopper, I'm recruiting for an assistant right now. You're a boy, won't you try? What does that mean? I don't know. Uh... Great, now that's the spirit, Grasshopper. Okay then, I'm going straight into my strategy. They'll appear all over the ranch. They'll aim for that barn and approach it slowly, so hit them with arrows so they can't get in. You got that? And you mustn't leave the ranch. <laughs> Grasshopper, let's practice right away. There are ten ghost-shaped balloons in the ranch, so hurry and burst them all. If you take over two minutes, you're out. Uh-oh. More like little games like this. The current record is one minute, I guess. Are you get, ready? Do I get a ride on Epona, like, at the very least? Oh, I do. Okay. Get it. How many are there? I Ten? love the little carrots. They're cute. Um, yeah. You enjoy the, like, whipping Epona carrots? Yeah. They're cute. I feel like that we should call that girl uh, Carly because she, Romani because she's like, oh, trying God. to save cows. You know, that's like the epitome of your and friend Carly. And she loves Carly. like horses and yeah. farms and stuff. Come on, I suck. You don't suck. I'm sorry, I'm yelling. Just do this while stationary. I don't get this because I'm gonna have to fight the things, not on horseback, as far as I remember, anyway. What, I don't know. What are these things, you may ask? It's well, so cool that you could fire arrows on a pona. I love that. Is that unique to this game? Like, uh, you can do that in no great time, can't I you? I know, I just think it's cool. It's not just unique to this game, I just... It's always really cool, in my opinion. That was a good shot, myself. Nice job. Nice shot. Nice shot, yeah. Yeah! As Sunny from Mario Golf would say. Don't you love, by the way, um, on the topic of Mario Golf references, that after having spent two weeks with us, Walt was starting to, like... Reference Harry, yeah. Harry, yeah. Also, by the way, um... Whoa, I really just aimed there. Was that all of them? Nope. Okay. Um. That's it. I also really love the music. Okay, you're done. <laughs> Romani. <coughs> One minute and eight seconds. Oh that's, no. That's great. You two were perfectly together. I, but I was slower than the like record. I'll teach Romani's horse calling song to you, Grasshopper. Yeah, but you won. So who cares? Okay. Now you two keep getting along and go practice some more. The horse seems to like this song. Yay! Ooh, a Pona song, I love it. She's so creepy. Uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, she's kind of creepy. <laughs> but who isn't creepy in this game? It's a creepy game. Also, I don't know why I gave her a Turna's voice from Setsuna. I noticed that it started to turn into a Turna's yeah. voice. It started to do a Turna. Stop! I, I, I'm sorry. God. Um. 
That's great. Aren't you I glad we moved past the Snowhead area? Yep. It is a Pona song. The song of two who are bound by trust. Aww. Sorry. Cough. Coffee. When your arrow hits these, they burst into nothing, but the real <laughs> ones will keep popping That's up. That's great. When your arrow hits these, if they get in the barn, we lose. I won't let them. They run away at first light of the sun, so we'll have to keep fending them off till then. Did you get that? The operation starts tonight at 2. I'll be waiting in the barn. Don't be late. Yeah, this sucks. Romani the ranch girl was added to your notebook. Good job. You've taken on the job of nighttime assistant. This was added to your notebook. Yay, the bomber's yeah, notebook that I She's never... literally Carly. Uh -huh. It's funny because I just called her creepy, so like what are you what are you trying to get me to like say about Carly? I'm not trying to get you to say that Carly's creepy, I'm just saying because like she like wants to protect the animals. That's like your friend That's in the That's a noble show. a noble cause. I don't think so. Carly's creepy. Carly's not creepy. I think you're creepier than Carly. Well I'm not I mean But I like your creepiness. I'm creepy and Carly's not, so I mean yeah. I like I like your creepiness, Belle. You do? Yeah, it's cool. Well, that's nice. Alright, you're not creepy. I'm I'm honestly more creepy than, like, you or Carly. Hmm. In fact, both of you combined, probably, I'm more creepy than. Interesting statement. Yeah. <laughs> it's Mama's house! <laughs> Ew. But yeah, aren't you glad that we're not in, um, the Snowhead area? You didn't really respond to that. Yes, I, I think like I did, but... We were in that part of the game for quite some time. Yeah, I'm kind of glad we moved on, personally. You'll just have to get the fairies off screen at some point, and then... I will. Do that. When I feel so inclined. And then once you get it, then we'll like on screen take them to the Great Fairy. Or maybe we'll forget again and go back in no, time. No, we'll make sure we take them to the Great Fairy. Yeah, I, I, yeah, that's fair enough. I'll show everybody actually. If like, you get like bored at night or something, you should just do it. You know, like while I'm at work or something during um, the week. Um. You're not gonna do it. That was the most like. No, I didn't hear you. I was busy thinking. You didn't hear what I said? Yeah. I said, if you get bored at night, like, during the work week, you should do it. That's possible, although I'm, like, highly unmotivated. Wow, I can't speak. Unmotivated during the work week. What do you want? Ew. This is Mamayu Zan's Yan's doggy racetrack, just like the sign says. Do you want to try a dog race? The minimum bet is 10 rupees. Yeah, we'll try it. Then first go in and fetch the doggy that you think will run the fastest and bring it here. Oh crap. Oh, really they're puppies. This is really stupid because because it, there's a certain mask that lets you talk to the dogs and then you can know for sure who's going to win, but I don't have that mask well, yet. Go get the mask. I can't just get it right away. It's going to take some time. And I don't want to focus on it because I want to focus on like the current task at hand. Is that doggy fine? Sure, why not? If the dog you brought me takes First place, you get triple your bet. Second place gets double. If the dog you've chosen places third through fifth, you'll break even and get back however much you bet. If your dog does any worse than that, you'll lose whatever you bet. Oh, man. Bet like 10 rupees. And it's too late now, but maybe I'll get lucky. If not, I'll just go get that mask and then do this again later. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of puppies. They're cute. Isn't this so silly? It is silly. It's really cute, though. It's a puppy race. They're little, they're little uh, Scottish terriers. Yeah, they're so My silly. aunt and uncle used to have them. My puppy's doing they're okay Look at the way so they far. hop! They're really cute. Look at my puppy! I know you don't like dogs, but these are cute little dogs. Uh-oh, I don't think your puppy's doing very no, well. No, mine's a very middle-of-the-road dog. Look at this. Very forgettable puppy. <laughs> yeah, maybe he could at least get fifth place. He's, like, leading the medium pack there. Yes, he is. And look, there's the, there's the crappy pack. Oh, no. <laughs> look at that. Look at that poor little guy. <laughs> the black one was leading They're really the cute, beginning. actually. I like it. I like the dog race. That was a bad choice. What a douche. If you don't know how your pup is feeling, you won't be able to know how it'll do in competition. Get with it. Jeez, God. Your fu fucking self, no, lady. No, you, you meanie. Hey, lady. You meanie. Oh, really? Lady, why don't you, like, go on a diet? Boom. That's... Roasted. Fucking roasted. How? Roasted. No. Roasted. We don't, we don't body shame on this Fine, channel. Fine, I'm not. Uh, I'm body shamed a video game character. I wouldn't body shame like a, a nor. you know. Not cool. Okay, I pretty much just I'm gonna dilly dally till midnight. Sorry, t till 2 a.m. Okay, dilly dally. I don't know. I mean, I kind of like. Can you find the dog mask? Do you know how to get it? What's over here? What is this? She's milking a cow. That mask? Oh, that's right. The town should be having its carnival soon. 
Oh. So that's the dog mask, right? Is that what she's talking about? What? What are you talking about? Isn't that what she said? That mask, she said. I don't... I don't know. Forget it. Forget it. So you're gonna go to the carnival? No. The carnival, like, happens at the, uh... Like, the, like, right at the... As the moon falls, you know? Oh. At the end. Like, I think that's when the carnival is. Goreman track? Gorman. Goreman? Goreman or Gorman. Hey, it's Mario and Luigi. Also known as, like, uh, Ingo from Long Long What Ranch. do you want? You know what this place is? This is the Gorman Brothers Horse Training Center. You got no business here if you got no horse. Now beat it, scram. What a meanie. The suspicious Gorman Brothers were added to your notebook. What a meanie. This is like 19th century. It actually looks more like two Luigis. Won't you buy some fresh milk? This is just between you and me. That milk they produce down yonder at the Romani Ranch is watered down a bit. It's not worth drinking. <laughs> we don't do that kind of thing here. Ours is the real deal. It's always fresh and full of vitamins. It's a true. I'll tell. I'll sell it to cheap just for you. How about it? I don't want your scummy milk. Fifty. God. Oh really? Milk. Milk. This good will cost you a double in town. This is a true. It's funny, yeah, going back to the 19th century comment, it's like, 19th century stories where, like, evil people are, like, ugly, you know? Yeah. It's like that. Yeah. Okay, you know what? I w now, I kind of wish I was playing the, um, the 3DS version of this because I could just skip to 2am, but I can't, <coughs> so. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna go get a heart piece. I'm pretty sure there's a heart piece in a hole in the ground near here, so I'm gonna try See, to find it. you've been pampered. By the DS I version. I haven't pepper. Now I just have to, the old-fashioned way, wait it out. Oh, man. How could we survive? We have to wait it out. Well, we've got each other. This reminds me of, like, in Earthbound, where you have to, like, wait behind a waterfall for three minutes, and you have to wait three actual minutes. It sucks. <laughs> that does suck. Yeah. Uh, and you can't move the control or anything, so it's a good time to just get up, take a pee. Those games you know? are so weird. I love them. They're so good. Oh yeah, I don't have a sword. Oops, I can't put it. I, mean, I might put that as an option for another... I'm gonna, so... You might as well do this, because I don't have a lot to say right yeah, now. Yeah, so basically, as you guys know, Chrono Trigger's after Setsuna, but after that, I'm gonna play another RPG, and I'm gonna have... I got a whole list of games that I wanna play, and I'm gonna do a whole video about it once the time comes. This is... We're, this is way in the future here. This, we're, this is gonna be a few months from now, I think, actually, because Chrono Trigger will take a little bit. Although not that long, because I'm quite good at that game, so. I'm trying to find a hole in the ground, by the way, in case you're wondering what the heck I am doing. That's okay. And I should probably meander with some more organization about me, but... Do you want me to get the strategy Wow, I just guy? lost a lot of rupees, dear god. Do you want me to... That uh, bird is gonna die! It's okay, calm down, calm down, calm down. I had like a hundred rupees, now like, I have thirty. Wow. Yeah, that bird needs to die, get him. Gotcha! Can you kill him? Come here, douchebag! How about fire arrows? Get with some fire arrows. Well, you don't just want him to die, you want him to, like, burn. Yeah, I want him to burn him to death. You want him to die a fiery death. I really want him to die, I yeah. feel like I must be able to kill him, okay? Like, fire arrows! Okay, hang on. Wait! <sighs> fire arrows! Sorry, I really want it. Let's just, like, waste my magic on shooting just, at this just, bird. Just one fire arrows. Ready? I hate that thing so badly! Well, I hate it badly, you look, know what look. I mean? Look, look. He's on fire. He's on fire! You're gonna <laughs> die! <laughs> die, burn! <laughs> he looks like a phoenix right now. I still, like, really don't have most of my, uh... How is he not dead? He was just on fire, like, three times I met in a row. Okay, you know what? I just lost all my money, basically. Oh, well. I think I just need to call it quits and move on with That was a life. pointless endeavor. <laughs> Alright. Wanna see me do something, at least? Yeah, go ahead. Sorry that I'm kind of just wasting time. It's okay. I did want to try to find a hole in the ground because I'm pretty sure there's a heart piece somewhere around here. Hey, Apona's gonna show up. There she is. I love Apona. That bird needs to just stay away from me. She's so cute. Look at Apona. She's she's so majestic looking. <laughs> yeah, she's a cutie. Did you notice that she's little too? She is. She's a little like 
a little a pony. She's like, aw. <laughs> get it? A pony. I get it. Nice job. Go, go, Link, go, Opona. Let's just do a little bit of exploration here. Young Link. What time is it there? It's supposed to be seven. Yep. God, you gotta wait forever. It's okay. I'll collect some stuff by like running okay. through all these bushes. I kind of need to anyway. Wait, there was a hole in the ground. Oh wait, I don't think that's the hole I'm looking for. This okay. is not the hole you're looking for. Uh, I'm not gonna. That's too easy of a. That's what she she said joke. So. Um. Yeah, <sighs> I'm, I'm just not gonna even bother. I'm just gonna mention that it could have been, but it's the joke that could have been, but was n never was. It's for the best. Look at this. It's the snowhead area. Go away from it. Why you? I done don't want to even see it anymore. You're done with it. I'm done with it. Yeah. Let's see what's in here. Like what's under this rock? Yeah, it's probably Walt. Excuse me. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't blow up a Pona now. She's gone. What do you mean she's gone? She's right there! Oh, she'll be fine. Look at her. She's... See? She's a powerhouse. That was really risky business there. What if you would hurt Epona? Okay, there's nothing in there for me right now. What are the stones about? Uh, I need something. Every, well, the... that I know the answer to that question. Rock and roll. Get out of here! Because the rolling You're stones? So oh, dorky. shit! Oh, yeah. And by the way, I hope everybody enjoyed, uh, speaking of rock and roll and music my album review that uh, was fun yep good old aqualung made me want to listen to it um, hey aqualung do 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 well you know what i can just like start to proceed in the next area and then like not continue with it you know what i mean okay look it's a beach it's a beach huh son of a beach look it i jumped over the fence which i only could have done now that i've got epona wow so you can go to a different place What's this place now? Maybe I shouldn't get started on the next, like, thing here. Great Bay Coast. Okay, so this is the area that that, that uh, stage in Super Smash Bros. Melee is, um, yep. is uh, based off of. By the way, Melee sucks. I can't stand that game. It used to be so good. Did you recently, like, do... No, that was the original Super Smash Bros. We played the original Super Smash Bros. Walt and I as a video, but we originally thought about Melee, and, like, honestly, uh, that game does not hold up to me any for me anymore. It re it's like... It, it was so good when it first came out. I loved it so much. I spent... I dumped so many hours into it, but it just really hasn't held the test of time, in my opinion. You know? Yep. By the way, I just realized that I forgot to speed up time again, so we just, like, were waiting way longer than we needed to. Yeah. Don't you just love Return me? Return the flow of time to normal? Yeah, that's what I... I should have done that immediately, but I didn't do it. Cause oh, because you slowed down time. Okay. I slowed down time not in this episode, but in a previous one. Aw, oh, man. So, oh, no. Yeah, so what I'm saying is that was incredibly stupid. That's okay. We're almost done with this episode, so we might have to do the, uh... That whole thing next time. Yeah, I guess. Ocean spi Oceanside Spider House, okay. We're not gonna go there right now. I'm really, like... I wasn't intending to go to this area in this episode. Yeah. Oh, well. That's okay. It's all good. Whoa, Fisherman's Hut? I'll let you do a voice. You. Do I don't want to do a voice. I don't enjoy doing voices. Then just read it generically. I've been catching fish in these seas for 30 years. That's exactly how I pictured his voice would sound. When it comes to catching fish, I'm even better than the Zoras. I doubt that, buddy. That's what I'd like to be saying anyway. Hey, you got into character. Lately, the seawater has gotten really warm. That's better, okay? Thank you. It hasn't helped my fishing at all. It hasn't helped my fishing at all. It... And what is worse is the water has gotten murky, so when I ship you out... You got it, see? Go ahead. I always lose my way, and somehow end ba back up at shore. We fishermen and even the fish <laughs> are in a real predicament. Come to think of it... Okay, it's even getting more... It's getting even more wooden. There was a Zora... Floating lifelessly out in the bay. Ew. Go ahead. But there's probably no helping him now. Well, we'll see. Let's go help him. Okay, go ahead. We still got like. We're gonna save Azora. At least we'll have done something good in this episode. We still got a few hours to go. Well, so. we did get a Pona. That's a pretty big deal. Yes, we did. We did. We did. We did. We got our horse back. Not every episode can be the most I don't, eventful I, episode. I don't know if I was um d danger. Keep out swing. We're due to murky water. Oh. I don't know if I I don't know if I was really paying attention well or not um, when Romani was talking, but did she acknowledge about how Epona got there or no? 
Uh, I don't know. I forget. I'll have to watch it back. So. Am I going the right way here? Yes. Here we go. Oh, it's a Zora. It's a floating Zora. Ugh, somebody. Ugh, I took too many drugs. I feel like you actually Please. got a good voice for that character. Ugh, get me. Get me, man. To sure. Oh man, I shouldn't eat that Taco Bell. Uh. How do I grab him? Oh, uh, they always say like not to swim. Go swimming until like an hour after you've eaten, but. Okay, here we go, grab. The Taco Bell was too good. And that was hot. And then the, eating the Taco Bell made me hot because it was spicy. I hope I'm going to shore, by the way. You are, yeah, you're moving, see? I love how I'm totally ignoring everything you're saying. Oh, God. Oh, I think I gotta. Uh, I'm gonna puke. I gotta get to shore. Whoa, man. We did it! Uh, Don't fall back in, buddy. Uh, uh, oh, man. Uh, uh, I shouldn't have washed it down with that tequila. Okay, now. Holy shit. Oh, my God. He's like, he's wounded. Have some uh, respect. I just don't. Uh, oh, man. Last time I go to Mardi Gras. Uh, oh, man. Oh, man. Stop it. I just don't. You're uh, killing God. me here. If only I could just. This is the longest walking sequence ever. No! Oh, fuck. No! I give up. Buddy! Wow, I just realized that was like the brick, you know? Uh, you know, bad boy. I was like, who's better than bad boy? Nobody! Okay, go I on. I am Mikau of the Zora people. Guitarist in the Zora band. Oh, fuck, he's a guitarist! Great! I think this is it for me. My final message, See, that's man. why that's why the music, or, or your voice for him was right, I yeah. thought. Will you listen to it? Sure will. Oh, man. He's like, I'm dying. Better pull up my guitar. Look how lively One, he is two, now. One, two, three. Oh, baby, baby, listen to me. The carnival's beginning soon. We're the ones there waiting to see. But that girl, our vocalist, she laid some strange eggs, and she lost her voice. You can't hear what she says. Whoa, whoa, in the Great Bay now, something is happening, is it now? Oh, baby, mm. listen to me, I don't want to beg Gerudo pirates, they stole that girl's eggs. I went to shop, oh. I went to stop the Gerudo pirates, then pow and bam, I got knocked down and here I am. There's like no con like consistent like melody here. Uh, he's obviously not a good musician. Baby, if I die like this, even if I die, I won't be in peace, that's for sure. Somebody oh. please rescue her eggs before the pirates take their toll. Oh, somebody, somebody, please heal my soul. Heal my soul. Heal my soul. That's all. Thank you. Uh, heal my soul in caps? All in caps. Let's, let, we better, you know what we're going to do now? Oh, wait, I forget the song. Of what time is it? Uh, it's only like eight o'clock or something or nine. We're good. Well, that sucks. Song of healing. In real time, it's like 4.17 mm -hmm. p.m. Mm, so it is. Do, 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 do. Better heal his soul. Well, hey, a band without a guitarist, you know. That would kind of suck. Some bands have done it. Well, yeah, yeah, they definitely have, but, um... It's gonna be a touching moment. Let's not talk through Look it. at his nose. It's cool. Here we go. This is so trippy. Whoa, what is this? We're healing him with the song of healing. Oh uh, man! Don't ruin it. I mean, I love these sequences. Taco Bell and Stop it! Tequila. Come on, uh, you're ruining. Like I love. The, it's like the the uh, vibe of the game. Whoa! Who's that beauty? All right, fine. I won't do it. I'm ruining it. Like is nothing sacred? Hey, but hey, babe. Stop it! She's. Is that supposed to be Rudo? No. It's the singer in the band who like doesn't oh. have a voice, remember? If you're listening to the song. Oh man, I love the drummer. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get to see more of the band, don't you worry. I hope so. They play some good tunes. Mm-hmm. Look, he's being healed. One of okay, remember. No, that? he's fading away. What the hell? He died. We healed him and he died. Are you serious? Yes, he died. That's sad. And that was, like, his love walking him, like, into the afterlife. Wow. Yay, we you got, got the Zora, Zora mask. mask. This mask contains the spirit of a legendary guitarist. Wear the mask with 
blank to inhabit the body of Azora. Press blank again to return to normal. By blank, I mean C. Hey, he's still alive. He's a ghost. Carve my farewell song on my grave. I'm depending on you to help that singer girl. Later, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. Later, bro. He's happy in the afterlife. All right, let's save. All right. And then we'll... Oh, I guess we're not. We... Is that his guitar? Yeah, now it's like a tombstone for him. Is Link crying? He's showing his respects. Aw. Go, Link. Let's we'll just look at it quickly. Here it... Herein lies Mikau, the legendary guitarist of the Zora tribe. He is to be remembered in song, and his lyrics are written here. Will you try to sing Mikau's oh, lyrics? Oh, crap, I didn't know this was gonna... Uh... This, you could always just hit... I won't I sing. I won't sing, and we'll come back to we'll this later. We'll come back to this later. Uh, there's a save point right over at that thing, so I'm gonna go to it. Okay. We've never been there before, but it's, like, literally right there. Okay. Ready for this? Alright, I wanna see Zora Link. This is gotta be cool. This is the the transformation that um, Walt predicted, by the way. Oh, yeah, that's right. Cool! I like Zora Link. He looks neat. It just sucks you don't have a guitar. How did a Zora. Oh, however, my friend. How did a Zora. Um, oh my god, yes. Thank god. Anyway. Um, moving right along. Alright, honestly, so far, like. This, oh my god, that is cool. This is the coolest transformation mask. Yeah, but the Goron, he was so cool. Ah, uh, no way, man. A, a Zora guitar player? Like, come on. Yeah, that's true. It's groovy, dude. Yeah, but the other guy was like a hero. Like, oh crap, I don't have a sword to... Can I really not, like, let's see if Ch I can check open it. it as, like... <sighs> fudge so cool. Are you serious? E fudge so cool. Okay. Are, are you kidding I me? I literally cannot do that because I don't have the swords. Let's go back to the mountain village. Cool. Oh, wait, no. Time. Let's go back to Milk Road. Cool. And then we could just save, right? Yeah. Song of Soaring. The Milk Road. There it is. Oh, oops. Um, I'm surprised you'd want to go there, given the fact that you don't drink milk. Oh, yeah, damn. Maybe it's... They make soy milk as well. Fine. Fine. You and your technicalities. Well, maybe they do. Maybe they do. He, look at it. He's like a fish out of water. Stop. Oh, God. Okay. Yep. Now we gotta go check on our pumpkin pie, which we're making at the Yes, moment. and then we will see you guys next time. Next time. We? Hopefully by then we'll be, like, it'll be 2 o'clock. Bye, guys. See you then. Peace.